The district's crop swap program offers financial incentives to its agricultural customers for crop conversion projects. We uh, came up with this idea in early 2015 as a means to uh, create water savings for agriculture here in the Temecula Valley. The impetus was to save water and we had, uh, during the drought, um, we had a huge problem. Uh, growers did, mostly on the west side, growing avocados and citrus. We decided that uh, growing grapes would be a much better way to go because grapes take so much less water than avocados and citrus. Any type of crop conversion is eligible for participation in the program so long as it saves water. Uh, examples of what people have done so far include avocado to wine grape conversions, avocado to citrus conversions, avocado to olive conversions, and conversions from citrus to other low water use crops. I heard about the Crop Shop program through the website. We had avocados and we swapped those out for tango tangerines. There should be approximately one third less water usage for the tangerines when they get to be mature. Uh, right now, uh, we just have babies and so they use a lot less water, but they're expected when they're mature to use about one third less water than the avocados used. The district was awarded a total of $3 million in grant funding through both the Department of Water Resources and the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation. The total process took about six months or so. Once we learned that we were eligible, then we just moved ahead with getting the approval for the plantings. The actual conversion process took about three months or so. And uh, once we were done, then uh, Rancho sends a check about a month or so after we finished. If you are an avocado grower interested in the crop swap program, you can benefit by receiving $15,000 per acre planted. That $15,000 an acre goes a long ways on a typical planted vineyard that's going to cost you $25,000 an acre. I mean, I personally found the process to be very user friendly. Um, there's, there's a on the crop shop website that they have for the Water District, there's the eligibility requirements, um, they're pretty clearly spelled out, um, and it's just a matter of sitting down and figuring out whether your crops are going to be eligible for the swap, and if you're going to be doing a swap, or if you're contemplating doing a swap, there's absolutely no reason not to participate. Benefits of the crop swap program are number one, we're saving water, two, we're keeping rates low for all of the district's customers, and lastly, we're sustaining the local agricultural economy. Not only does it save uh, the district imported water costs from the Metropolitan Water District. It allows us to retain our green belts in the uh, Temecula area. If you think you may be eligible for participating in CropSwap, give us a call or log on to ranchowater.com slash CropSwap and we can walk you through the process.